your dog out of my face. Get the hot dog out of my face. Get the corn dog out of my face. Lord, thank you so much for this beautiful day. and Thank you for all the ways you've blessed us. We ask that you forgive us where we fall short. And thank you for this food. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Oh, man. Oh, baby. This is good looking stuff. Every day it never gets old. Nope, it never does. <laughs> Greasy eggs. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. Pico. Hot sauce. Oh yeah. Yup, that's the stuff. Ooh, Tabasco. Did you Tabasco yours yet? No. I've kind of been on a kick where I like to get a few bites <laughs> of just the egg and the cheese and You're stuff. You're pressy. <laughs> Don't judge my eating habits, woman. Wow. Tabasco. And then you want the Tabasco. But it's like, you know, the old school breakfast taste of all the breakfast stuff. You know, like, it would be better if it was hot. And yeah. then you put the hot sauce on. It's always better hot. Oh, it's just good. This is the taste of morning. <laughs> yeah, I think, if, I think if I was told that lunch and dinner had been canceled forever and it was just going to be replaced with perpetual breakfast, it'd be all right. I'd be okay with that. Mm. Might as well drain the swamp here. Black coffee, hot sauce. I made this yesterday. Really? We ate that whole thing in 24 hours. Sure, why not? Yeah. That's good stuff. 
And I don't know why I've brought this tiny little Tabasco. You ever tried to use one of them little food processors to do the Pico? No. I, it would be interesting to try. Yeah. I don't know what to do. So it's a blended Pico, you mean? No, the ones that chop. And it's got the two blades. Right, but I mean, you take it so far, it's going to really make it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'd like to try it. Now, I've just pulse it a couple times. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that tastes so good. Mm -hmm. So the last time we were here, we had water for a minute. We punched the well, we put the pump on, got water for a minute, and then we couldn't get the water to stay primed in the pump. Turns out the leathers that are in the pump were completely junk. So we got some new leathers. We're gonna put the pump back on and hopefully we'll have water. Just like that, super cool, in just a few minutes. Okay, that's probably good. Give this a second so those leathers can soak up a little bit of water. Doesn't feel like it has any grip at the moment. Okay, so the pump leathers have been soaking for 10 minutes or so. Top the sucker off. That's our water. I think so. That's it right there. Yes. Now we're gonna pump this for a while to get all of the uh, sediment out of the pipe. Water. Yay. We're gonna keep pumping. I'm gonna dump this one. We'll see what the next pan looks like. Oh, it's so satisfying. All right, that's the third pan of water. It's just definitely getting clearer. That's good. Cheers. Cheers. Got a little pipe taste to it. Yeah, that's what I wondered about. Cause I like saw a sheen or something on there. Like, is there some oil or something that got greased? Well, there's all the stuff from the pipes. Let's keep pumping. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't taste good. That was anticlimactic. Yeah. <laughs> Dang. So we got our water, we got it running. The replacement leather on this pump is working so much better. Well, the first one didn't work at all. So this one is perfect. Now the only thing we're dealing with is just a foul taste and smell of the water. And that's just from residue oils and stuff in the manufacturing process of the pipe, the joint compound. We're just trying to, we're just trying to flush that out of the system. And it is starting to smell better and taste better. And we've got nice, clear, I mean, ice cold water. This is from the Superior Watershed. This water is the best you can get. So super excited to have water on our property with a well that we punched ourselves. Super, super cool. Yeah! All day today, I've been digging out stumps and stubs, stuff I cut last year. So you're walking around, it's just like, dunk, 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 you're tripping all over these little stubs and roots, and it's really annoying. So this is one of the bigger ones. A lot of mine get with this shovel and an ax. This one, I don't know. We'll see. Boy, when that is cleaned out, that's gonna be good water. It is getting better. There it was.
So guys, if you like this video, check out the whole playlist starting from when I was looking for land, to buying the land, to getting the deal, to clearing till this point. I'll see you in the next video. This girl in the woods, she gone. Oh, don't forget to get outside and get happy. Happy.